Hello there, this is Russ Buecher from Control My Icon. In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can modify the language settings in Control My Icon. By default, Control My Icon version 5.0 only ships with the English language, and we hope to include more languages in the future. However, you can modify the text that is displayed on the window, and you can use that to do a very rough translation of what is shown. Let's bring up the language window and to do that you go to the file menu, language, and here it is. So here you can see we only have one language. We'll have some more in there soon. But on the left hand side is the native translation. So if I scroll down a little bit and let's say I wanted to translate this word file here or just change it to something else. Here it is right here. Now over here is the translated one and right now they're identical. So here is the native and here is the translated version of the native. So, so let's say I wanted to change it from the word file to folder. To save it and then you'll need to restart control my icon for the changes to take effect. And now if we look in the upper left hand corner, it says folder. So let's change it back. It originally was file. Go down to F. Then save. And restart. If you've made modifications to the language on one of your computers and you would like to move that over to your other computers, all you need to do is move the language file with it. So I'm just going to bring up Windows Explorer and go to the folder where I've installed Control My Icon. Right here. And it has a data subfolder. And this folder contains the TTC translation.fdb. This is a database file with all the translation data into it. So if you made any changes, it's in here. If you have other computers in which you'd like to use your translation, just copy this file over to those other installations. And that's it. That's how you translate Control My Icon. Happy tethering.